Do you know anyone on the list? The Courier's website was busy last week with lots of clicks on the story revealing the new 40 Under 40 class. The Business Courier's annual, annual awards program honors young professionals in greater Cincinnati who are making big strides in their career while also making a difference in the community. Business Courier publisher Jamie Smith is in with producer Kelly Leon to talk about who made this year's list. Jamie and Kelly. Thanks, Peg. Jamie, you're not used to being in that seat. I know, I'm you on the wrong on side, side of the stage. <laughs> All right, so so the list, who made it? Like, do, who who are these people that made it, and how did they get on the list? You know, it's it's not an easy list to get on. No. And to kind of give you an idea, this year we had 398 nominations. Wow. For those 40 spots. Now, some people, you know, get more than one nomination. Some get five, ten, whatever. Mm -hmm. So we had a, oh, just over 200 unique nominations. So 200 individuals were nominated for this award. And it's it's gotten to the point where it's, people like to have it on the resume. You know that yeah. they made this class. Yeah. You know, if you look at past winners, and you know, we've been doing this for 22 years, and if you look at our very first class in 1995, uh, you you see people's name on there like George Vincent, managing partner at Densmore. Uh, you see people on there like uh, Crystal uh, Faulkner uh, from now MCM, what was Cooney Faulkner Stevens, Laura Bruner from the Port Authority. Some pretty impressive pretty, people. Yeah. You know, if you go throughout the years and you look at different classes, Jill Meyer from the Chamber, John Arita from Ready. So people that have were in that shoes of being future leaders that now are the leaders of our city. So yeah. it's pretty impressive. That's awesome. Um, in terms of this year's class, Give me the big picture. Sure. Who's on the list? <laughs> when you look at, like, all, as I said, we had 300 and some nominations. The top number of uh, in that class were 31 directors. So they're d executive director of something in their organization. We had 26 vice presidents, 18 owners, 21 CEOs. So these are all very high level people. Uh -huh. If you narrow that down to the actual, you know, once we narrowed it down to 40, the top spot were CEOs. We have nine CEOs, six vice presidents. Five attorneys, four uh, doctors or uh, professionals in the health organization. Mm -hmm. So, again, very highly qualified. Uh, when you, when you look at these winners, their titles say they're they're big in their business, but what that doesn't say is what their resume shows and what their application shows is not only are they succeeding in the business place, but they're giving back to the community one way or another. And part of the goal with this too is to recognize them to keep them here. Absolutely. So. Now they're the under 40 leaders. Hopefully they'll be the senior leaders. Absolutely. Is that yeah, when we look, you know, we talked about that first class. Yeah, you look at that. That's right. Three out of 40 are making big differences right now. Yeah. And probably if I went through that class further, there's probably more than that. And you have a big fun event coming up. Yes. In the, fall. Uh, the actual uh, awards event will be September 19th at the Hyatt. Okay. And it's always a fun event. If, yes. you've, if you've gone it of is. recent years, yeah. they pick their walk up music. Yeah. Uh, they get a little excited. Yeah. Uh, their fan clubs come. <laughs> uh, it's at the Hyatt. <laughs> so yeah, go to CincinnatiBusinessCourier.com under events and you'll find 40 under 40 and make sure you come and support your, you know, your favorite 40 under 40. All right. Thanks so much, Jamie. All right. Thanks.